Alpine Ascension. Today, I want to talk to you about stepping out of fear and into love, into our connection and trust in spirit, in the universe. In today's society that we live in, we live in a, in a society in green and fear, fear of viruses, fear of the unknown, fear of rejection, fear of love. These are just examples. But fear serves a purpose. It is to keep it is to keep us alive, to keep our physical vehicle alive when we come into danger. Before we had the society, we had, you know, animals or tribes that would attack us and you know in the natural world Fear is the driving force to keeping us alive. But the way this society is set up, it is created, it is almost ingrained in our society that we need to be in a constant state of fear. And you see this in the mainstream media, you see this and you see this all over the world especially with everything that's going on today with the virus and everything and the riots, there's just so much fear coming up to the surface. You know, people are afraid of a virus that has a 1% mortality rate. 50% of, it has even a less percent of a chance of 1% of a mortality rate. 50% of people that get this virus don't even know they have it. And I understand people are dying out there, but what what people what you need to understand is the soul chooses to leave the body when it's their time. And what we're seeing with all these people passing right now is because this ascension is happening, this harvest, and these souls are leaving right now. All these souls and masses are leaving right now because they're not ready for this ascension. It's, it is their time to leave before the shit hits the fan. So we need to step out of fear, step out of separation. And let me give you an example. A, a zebra doesn't worry about a lion attacking it his, its whole life. It doesn't worry about it. But when that lion comes to attack the zebra, then... It is ready and then that fear kicks in and, and that's that saves its life. And what you see now in our society is people stressing, people fearing about things that haven't even come to pass yet. They're out of their present moment in their mind in a state of lower vibration and fear. And what the mainstream media does is it brings all these things up to the collective for us to be in a state of fear, to be afraid of all of these things that are happening in the world instead of putting out positive things that are happening in the world, positive changes, all the, all the good things that are happening in this world. There's so much good things happening. And it's all, all the negative is, is uh, portrayed in mainstream media. And when we move into love, we are we are multi-dimensional beings. So when we see, when we understand that things happen for a reason, when we switch our perception into one of unity, of oneness, that we're all one, that we're all connected, that this whole reality is just an illusion for us to have this physical experience, then we move into a higher state of consciousness, this higher state of vibration, and we move into a state of trust, a state of trust with the, with the one infinite creator, with the spirit that is within us. And we do that by going in, by meditating. You could do it by taking plant medicine like mushrooms or ayahuasca to open you up to it. There's, there's many paths to the mountain to the top of the mountain, but it, it all leads to the same place. It leads within. You need to find that balance of within and 
the inner realm and the outer realm. And the Buddha calls that, the Buddha called it the middle path. Well, once you find that middle path, you understand that everything happens for a reason, that you have a purpose, that you are an infinite spiritual being having a human experience. And that we are here for a reason that we chose to be here. And we live in trust. We know that, that everything is going to be fine. That everything is going to be the way it is meant to be. If death, if death comes to me, if it's my time, I will welcome it. But I have work to do here. I am not afraid. Through my spiritual awakening, I went through a lot of fear. I went, I, I was scared as shit with everything that was happening to me. And I had to overcome that fear. I overcame that fear and now I know that I am here for a reason. And that we are all here for a reason and the shift is happening. And we, we can't live in fear because it's not serving us. It's not serving us to be in a lower state of vibration. When that fear comes up, feel it, but don't get attached to it. That That is how you step away from the fear and into love, into unity, into knowing that we're all one, knowing that we are all sparks of the one infinite creator having this experience and just, we're just that we're on different levels of vibration so like i said before we do that by going within once you go within then you can bring that out into the world and people will notice how calm you are. People will notice and they will be curious about it. But so many people are still stuck in fear. And it's time for us to move out of that. So that's why I'm making this video. And you don't need to be afraid anymore. All right, peace. Love you guys. Alpine Ascension. Out.